Time for a little twin magic. Two main event competitors who are absolutely unstoppable as a team. Yeah, all thanks to a little Twin magic. Bree and Nikki Bella about to show why they are the greatest women's tag team in history. Corey, what's the champ's mindset right now heading into this huge title defense? Confidence is key, Cole. They have to remind themselves that they are the absolute best WWE has to offer right now. Yeah. The moment they doubt that is the moment we could very likely see them get picked off. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers, Nikki and Bree, the Bella Twins. And their opponents, they are the WWE Women's Tag Team Champions, Dakota Kai and 
Io Sky. Damage control. The WWE Women's Tag Titles has dramatically changed the women's division, and it will continue to do so tonight. Bell rings for the Women's Tag Team Championships in this tag team match, and we are starting things off with Brie Bella and Nikki Bella. Then across from them we see Dakota Kai, Indio Sky. And here's where you gotta have the utmost faith in your partner, especially with the gold on the line. Corey, I don't think you would do well in one of these. Uh, I've been a tag team champion, Saxton. Do your freaking research. Great display of power into the German. Being able to pull that off, no one is going to question if you skip going to the gym today. Dakota Kai digging down deep, trying to gain some momentum from the WWE Universe. Wow, oh, that hurt! Goes without saying, but a leg injury will hamper your ability to do just about anything. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this junction. She catches Kai with a big counter. Elbow smash. She uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. Some momentum. The champion into the cover. And a shoulder in the air. Clearly, she's still got a lot of fight left in her. She bails in a hurry. There goes Nikki Bella. Sent hard to the outside. Bullseye with the drop kick. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. Three. Gets put into the barricade. Face first. Dakota Kai is beaming here. And yeah, guys, she's dangerously close to a count out loss. A oh, torturous knee. The challenger not looking good right now. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Now tagging her in. Now oh, look at this. The power. Oh, God. Superhuman power. What a slam. Uh-oh, this is just vicious, vicious arm stop. Tracking the opposition. Oh, what a kick. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. Whoa. Look out! Suicide dive to the outside. Cole does it better. That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. And now thrown back into the ring. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Looks like there's some more fight left in her. She sent to the outside. Now there's an arm breaker right to the spine. Nikki with the power buster. Gets the tag. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
measured kick to the vertebrae. With the tag is Nikki Bella. Oh, come on. Get back in the ring and fight. Oh, maybe she wants to take the fight outside. Boom! Nikki Bella traps the arm. STO! The champ's shoulders are down. There's a shoulder up almost immediately. What stamina. It's truly impressive to completely beat the counter. Nikki's got... Uh-oh. Oh, look at her answering back. It's the drop kick. isn't going to be pretty. Pavement's neck break. Gosh. Shut your face up in that one. Gets tagged in. The confidence, the poise, the undoubtable spirit of Dakota Kai is beaming here. Reaches her partner. Tag. Just in time. 
time. If you look at the end of the the title will change hands. Cover. Two. Wow, just barely making it out. The title still hanging in the balance. Resilience of a champion on display. Nikki Bella not used to losing, but also no stranger to hard work. This will only make her double her efforts. but that one sure did. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing Damage Control from San Jose, California, the WWE Women's World Heavyweight Champion, Bayley. Now, Bayley claims that she's the one that built the women's division. It's a claim Bailey has every right to make. She's the longest reigning SmackDown Women's Champion in history at 379 days. Listen, Bailey couldn't be more aggressive. She couldn't be more vicious. And she claims she's a role model for all the women in WWE. I can't believe Bailey has gone so far as to shave the name of her rival in the back of her head. Who does that? Well, those of us that have hair to work with Saxton generally try to do mind games like that. Maybe we can get you a dry erase board for your head. The nightmare is real. Here comes Rhea Ripley. 
unchecked aggression in the women's division. And representing the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia, the women's champion, Rhea. Physically imposing and a talented athlete. This is a woman who knows how to put her strength to devastating use. Uh, Rhea Ripley is capable of anything inside the ring. You've got to respect that. Maria Ripley looks ready to torment yet another victim. What's the matter over there, Saxton? You feeling a little squeamish? A little uncomfortable. Maria Ripley in the ring and ready to get things going here. She certainly lives up to the nightmare moniker. You're not getting a lot of sleep when you know you're facing off against Rip. Referee in position. It's a little early for an earnest attempt. <laughs> She hit the corner hard. Well scouted by Ripley. And that prevents Bailey's attack. Kick to the gut. Ooh, brutal forearm. Talk about rocking the jaw. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here all day. Power. I think you're right. Not long. Scratching and clawing. This could be it. She still fights out in one. You expect these pins to last much longer at this stage in the match. Stop anybody. Putting a stop to all her showboating. Oh. He finds a counter. Ooh. Corey, if you're butting heads with Rhea Ripley, what's the most important thing to watch out for? It's got to be her ultra aggressive streak. She's going to come at you hard with everything she's got. Without stop. No, no, no. Oh, straight to the floor. I don't care how bold you are. Missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A well, medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. Going right after the shit. Nasty dragon screw. Ooh, what a forearm club. She's trying to ask for mercy, but not even tapping out can help her. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Arm breaker! She's beginning to flag a little. Oh, what a knee! Delivered into the barricade. Face foot off the barricade. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Close line. Oh, what a strike to the back. 
She's in danger of a count out here. I don't know if she cares. Holy, meet the barricade. She's into the ring again. Another peek of the moves he saw in that match. Here is your winner, Bailey. A countout win is still a win. When a match is decided by countout, it leaves you wondering where this match could have gone. A young star with plenty of accolades. The youngest United States champion and the youngest Money in the Bank winner in WWE history. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia. Weighing in at 220 pounds. Austin Theory. All the potential in the world. But unfortunately, a bad attitude, too. This guy has everything going for him. Amazing physique, endless charisma, a surefire future main eventer. The future has become the now, Cole. Austin Theory is already primed for the main event in WWE. Saxton, get out of the way. You can't be in this selfie. Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam! From ACW stand-up to WWE legend. One of the most unique athletes sports entertainment has ever known. No one in this business gets as high as RVD with the five-star frog stretch. Which reminds me, guys, it's 418. I'll be back in a few minutes. Whoa, whoa, where are you going? There will only be one. Rob Van Dam. when we saw those initials on the card tonight. R.V.D. Rob Van Dam is one of the most exciting superstars to ever step through the ropes. I can rattle off his list of achievements, but anyone who doesn't know what R.V.D. has done has been living under a rock. Anyone who watches R.V.D. is certainly in for a show tonight. The whole damn show. We'll have a tough time tonight because Austin Theory is like someone made a superstar in a laboratory. His stats are maxed, and he's as hungry as it gets. Theory may be young, but he is literally built for success. Uh, Theory's age is the biggest mark for and against him. Thus far, his natural abilities have won out. We'll see if they do again here tonight. Kick! Oh. Oh, a well-measured strike. What a thunder frog splash! He thinks he has it! He's able to beat a two count. Not quite enough to put him away. Oh, what a kick. Whoa, the height on the moon side. Placed in 
the corner. Gets him with the counter. Close line. Just a relentless assault from Van Dam. You can tell RVD is lighting up now. superstars we've ever seen, Corey. What's your game plan going into a fight with RVD? While RVD's a great striker, high flying is obviously his forte. If you can keep him from the top rope, or better yet, ground him, you've tilted the table in your favor. Held in a perilous position. Face first! The cockiness of theory on full display. Coming. Big time power. RVD just getting knocked around. He's really grounding RVD thus far. The match is tilting away from Van Dam in this moment. There he goes, right into the corner. Wow, again, shoulder to the midsection. We're only showing off if it doesn't work. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out. Oh. show here's another look here is your winner Rob Van Dam. no other way to put it guys that was kind of a butt kicking never a doubt there a moment suspense this one was about as lopsided as they come I got a feeling this match is going to be too sweet. 
one of the most dominant and decorated teams in the world. The following is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by AJ Styles at a combined weight of 505 pounds. Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows, the OC. The most dominant club in the world. Marching towards the pinnacle of their collective careers. Scanning the scene in the ring tonight, and the OC is looking to start up a fight. There's no escape, and that's for sure. Styles, Anderson, and Gallows always looking for war. The undeniable Cody Rhodes is back. And ready to stake his claim atop WWE. tag team and Intercontinental Championship reigns during his first run here in WWE. But now that the prodigal son has returned, Cody Rhodes has reached main event status. Cody Rhodes is a superstar who possesses an in-ring IQ second to none. Well, Cody Rhodes has certainly learned from the best and Rhodes has become even better in his time away from WWE. But is better good enough these days? It's Seth Viking Rollins. A man who has spent a decade atop WWE with the accolades to prove it. And from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the WWE Champion, Seth Freakin' Rollins! A decade of being WWE's freaking workhorse and the WWE Universe is finally singing his praises. I don't think anybody in WWE runs their mouth quite as much as Seth freaking Rollins. Yeah, but nobody delivers on their promises like he does either. Some good old-fashioned tag team action here. There's such a distinct attribute that makes a tag team successful. It's an indefinable quality. We're about to see which one of these teams possesses that X factor here. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. He gets set down to the floor. Mm. 
Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, elbow caught him right on the bridge of the nose. Kick to the gut. Ranked around into a neck breaker. Lifting prowess and just tossing. He may get the three count right here. This is it. And a quick kick out. How at this point you don't even stay down long enough for a one count is beyond comprehension. A bear hug squeezing the breath out of them. The architect going to have to design a count. The bear hug cinched in. Got to find a way out and catch your breath. Look at this. No quit whatsoever. Ready to and escaping the bear hug. Knew what was coming there. A sequence of reversals there. Close the line on the back of the neck. Oh. Tag made. Here we go. it more. Well placed elbow to break up the maneuver. 
Cody Rhodes looking for here. Oh my! Breaker. Is it enough? The cover. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. No. Oh, I just completely off target there. No, that was a harebrained idea to try that. Was trying to find a way to attack, but completely wiped out. Solution. And he scores a reversal on Rollins. Oh, right to the leg. Listen to this place. Oh. Uh oh. Elbow drop. Tag is made. He's in a little bit of trouble now. These two 
teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Gallows felt that coming. And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Using the elbow as a weapon. Rollins lining it up. That could be Gallows' demise. Tagging his partner in now. Boom! Cody Rhodes lining it up. The American Nightmare. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners, Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. This pairing paying strong dividends with an impressive tag team win. The wrestling gods have truly blessed this union. I fully expect to see more showings like this going forward from this duo.